Hello and welcome. In this video, I'm going to show you how to download to your website using Filezilla. Uh, first of all, we have to have a website. Okay, I'm going to show you from Composa, a website which I have already prepared. Remember that everything that it goes into a web page has to be saved into a folder. And then that folder and the page that you have created, you have to be saved and published using FTP. In this case, we are going to use Vizilla. I'm going to show you step by step how easy it is to upload it. Hola, aquí estamos en Composa and HTML editor in which you can change anything to a website. So any change that you make, don't forget, first of all, you have to save it. Now Composa is one of the more easy to use probably HR editors there is in the market because we allow us to before we um, publish into the web to view how the page will look. To do that, just press in browsing and here you are. This is what actually it will be. We have to do, we have to save this into a folder or save the page as a full page. Okay. Um, we're going to put this in my desktop click it here and we're going to find already have a folder in here uh, let me see if I can find it uh, there we are why see the test opening that folder uh, and we will save this into the folder as you save it you will not only save the page but we will also save the folder with all the images that you will need to publish this. Click save. In this case it will tell me that I already have that folder saved so anyway I press yes and that's it. That is safe in there to allow us to publish this into the internet. I'm going to pause this video now and we're going to go directly to uh, Faisila and publish in there. Okay, see you in a minute. I'm in Faisila now, and as you can see, there are four different departments in the Faisila. This one is, it shows us what is in your computer, in this case, in my tech phone. And down here is where we are going to put the folders and the web pages that we want to, to publish and in this window in here which at the moment is completely empty is the server this is your hosting company this is where we are going to publish and where all the folders and pages are going to go and in this window at the bottom you will see in here the progress of the files as they are uploading to the server okay so first thing we have to do is connect. To connect, we are going to connect to your main um, hosting um, domain, uh, domain, your uh, principal domain. To do that, we have to put ftp dot, and now we put the domain name, your domain name, but without the www. So we go straight to jtruthnetwork.com because this is the domain which I'm going to publish, show you how to publish this web page. In here you put your username and in here you put the password that you have chosen or the your hosting company has given you. Okay. Now all we need to do is connect. We click in the quick connect and we'll be connecting to your server. 
and that's it. And here you will see a lot of folders and a lot of information. There is nothing concerning you at all in here except the public HTML. If this is the folder we are going to publish. So when we double click in here, in the remote side, it will show you a public under core HTML. Now we have to choose. In your case, this will probably have just the domain name that you are going to um, download the web pages. In my case, because I have a lot of uh, domain names, they are only here. So anyway, I'm going to look for JCruise Network. This one in here. Double click on it, and we will see showing at the top in here. So now we have public underscore HTML forward slash jcruisenetwork.com don't forget that the three W's do not appear anywhere right in here I already have all, um, downloaded a lot of uh, web pages and, and files uh, forget about that in here is where we're going to put what we want to, to publish to the web so you go through your, your desktop and you find the folder which you want to to publish remember that in that folder you will have two folders I mean you will have a folder and an index so in here the squeeze in this that is your web page and in this folder in here is where all the images in that pages are stored so you have to publish both of them so when the website is published is visible in the internet right so to publish this very simple all you do right click the window open up and it asks you to upload click upload and if you see at the bottom in here you will see the progress of the folders transferring the files from there to here because I have already done this before uh, he asked me if you want to overwrite or uh, save it with different size so anyway this is nothing to concern you uh, I click OK and that's it all the files as you can see the progress 100% done the other one is doing so that's it all the folders are now already hosted in your hosting company all we need to do now is the same with the web page click upload and take a few seconds and that's it okay so we are in Google uh, we are going to put in the search bar the website address in which we have published the web pages um, all you need to do is put the domain name um, I put my domain um, network punto com and forward slash and now you type the name of whatever page you have uploaded to the internet or pages okay so in this case my page was subscribed as I've done it before disappear automatically now all I have to do is open it up and that's it okay as you see it's very simple very easy and it doesn't take the market for any more information you would like about how to do anything whatsoever in the internet please visit our website we have tons of information uh, in English and also so in the Spanish so you're welcome to come and have a look and help yourself to all the information which is free that we have in there. Thank you very much and see you soon.